I'm friends, or at least good acquaintances, with a number of D&D &D YouTubers. Performance Check, Puffin Forest, Tabletop Terrors, the list kind of goes on, depending on who you ask. But one among them has actually been publishing tabletop gaming books for a number of years now, and I haven't actually been reviewing any of them for my channel because I'm a bad friend, but I've finally got the time to do it. So here it is. Oath of the Frozen King. Oath of the Frozen King comes from the publishing company Absolute Tabletop, which came from the YouTube channel Tabletop Terrors. May you mend the first break. May you kill the first snake. May you conquer everything you undertake. Slancha. <sighs> Slancha. Santa? Slancha. Sanja. Slancha. Slancha. Sanja? Slancha. Sandcastle. Slancha. Yeah, those guys. Oath of the Frozen King is an adventure kit that is meant for 5th edition Dungeons and Dragons, but really it can be used for just about everything. It contains lore and material for Absolute Tabletop's campaign setting, Dragon Grin, and serves as a broad tool for campaign creation. If your players are the fish and your campaign is the hook, then this book would be your tackle box. That's the best analogy that I can think of anyway. It's not an adventure path or a splat book or a bunch of shopping lists. It's more of an idea book that helps you quickly and easily create campaigns around the theme of extreme cold and undead skeletons. There must always be a Lich King. Now, now, before you start poking fun, remember, this is not a big, faceless corporation. This is like ten people or less putting out something glossy, well-made, and fully realized. I got a physical copy and a PDF in order to do this review, so I can already tell you it's actually well worth the money spent. So what is the Oath of the Frozen King? The Oath itself. What did he say? Just before his head died. His last words were, Death is but a door, time is but a window, I'll be back. Well, not quite. Somewhere buried on page 10 in way too small letters given its importance is the Oath of Winter. Right before the Frozen King was put to death after enslaving and ruining the region of Varnholm, no, there isn't a map, there really should be, he said the following, Varnholm is mine in life. It shall remain mine in death. I shall return and restore glory to my kingdom. Then you will know the coldest winter. Then you will suffer the slowest, surest death. Ouch. With that being said, the book quickly branches out into various dungeon design generators, beautiful maps, module rooms you can arrange however you want, and plenty of charts and tables to fill them with interesting stuff. Now again, this was made with 5th edition in mind, but the stat blocks for monsters and NPCs are simplified, so you can just slot in things however you please, so they make sense for your preferred tabletop game. I could just as easily use this for Pathfinder or even Call of Cthulhu if I wanted to. It's jammed full of ideas, NPCs, loot, and more. With a fistful of dice in about half an hour, you could probably throw together a campaign session with just this book in front of you. Ease of use and expediency were definitely in mind when making this. Absolute Tabletop doesn't want you to sit there for hours planning everything by yourself. They want you to spend about 20 minutes and then be able to start playing. Even if that isn't your style, you can still add your own stuff in later. This is about building a quick framework and quickly moving forward. It lessens the burden on any potential DM that wants to make a chilly, undead themed campaign campaign like this. It's pretty cool. And that was Oath of the Frozen King. I hope you enjoyed this video. I certainly enjoyed this book just because it's so small, but it's jammed full of all these charts and tricks and ideas just to expedite the idea of a frozen undead campaign creation. It's it's got all the uh, the framework set up to where you can just like roll some dice, look at a chart, throw some stuff on a piece of paper, and then later on when you feel like it, you can add your own details. And it's really good. It's uh, expedite is the best way to probably 
put it. It's, it makes everything so much faster because it's already here and organized for you with everything in mind for a concept like an undead king that lives in a frozen wasteland tomb. So it's really interesting. It's definitely worth the purchase price. And I know I'm kind of shelling for my friends, but uh, I really liked this one. So it definitely earned a place on my bookshelf. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit that like button. Um, the, the link to the website where you can buy this, whether real or a PDF, is in the description below. All that good stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. So keep gaming. Quit it! Our undead frozen king guy has a big hammer, not a sword. Jerks. TabletopTerrors.com Subscribe to our channel.